Hello, good evening. Hello, Paolo. Hello. Now, can I say how beautiful you look? Oh, can I can I say thanks to Dave from Brick, yeah. uh, especially Brick for knitting it, um, and it actually matches perfectly the bright rosa colour. That is right because your bright rosa is your one day special, um, and these are absolutely divine dyes. And also, Thank can you. I say they create different effects? Like it's a little bit different. Yes. Uh, well, uh, basically, what I like to do with cut paper is kind of more a paper engineering, yeah. kind of just using it. But also, I wanted to be easy and I wanted people to be able to do quick and easily um, intricate cards right absolutely so therefore uh, when it was back in June for Christmas I kind of came up with this concept of the hexagon card and mm -hmm. they look at the hexagon card and I really like it. And all the people said, oh, I really, really like the idea of the card having the front of it a little bit more pointy. So then I kind of said, well, we have done the hexagon. We have got the elongated hexagon. What else can we do? And so I decided to go for the diamond shape. Mm. So it fits on a 5 by 7 so the rectangle in there. If I show you the yes, board, please, yes. then we can see it. So basically, the main die is that one. So that when it is fold, that's five by seven. So it will fit on a five by seven envelope. Perfect. Now it will cut the flowers on the edges, but then you have the ability to obviously with a pair of scissors trimming them up if you wanted to go for a more geometric pattern. So mm -hmm. you have got there the ability to do then you have got the corners, you have got the banners because there was a little bit of space, so I decided to use that. And also the hexagons, the larger one matches that one. Mm -hmm. So trying to do as much as possible. Also part of the one day special is the panel, the five by seven panels, because I kind of this pattern, okay, so if Go I show it. you this Can pattern you here, yeah. uh, when I was playing with it, um, when I kind of was creating, this was kind of in the borders, edges of it, and I thought, it's really nice. How can I incorporate it? So I decided to do a five by seven panel with uh, one of my favorite edges, which mm -hmm. is a postage stamp. Fabulous. So Should we look at samples? Yes, yes, yeah, shall we? So basically, the, the most basic of uh, the cards that you can make, or mm -hmm. not non basic, but you know, the kind of a standard, is to create that beautiful card with the flowers that cuts mm. the edges, but also you have the option to cut it into it. And of course, it has got the diamond, so you can have it into vellum. You have got the option of the, cor the corners, but of course, you can have it horizontally as well. Now, this card will, f if I put it in here, go for it. It's just kind of a little bit. What I wanted to show oh. you is right. the fact that it will stand proud oh, good. on the point. That's the whole thing about these cards. Or the, like that, or if you wanted to go for the geometric, I mean, obviously, I'm a little bit. I'm a little bit nervous today for some reason. Oh, but bless you. No, it looks really but great. You can see that on the point, it will f fall. It, so yeah. that's what it, w it will stay a standard. Now, so I, obviously, with I'm holding it, mm -hmm. not a set, but you can see in here that you can do the geometric. But other cars that the design team have made, like mm -hmm. Nikki Gilbert here, look at that, using different Stunning. ways. Look at that. Look at this. Beautiful, oh, and then, classy that. Then I'm going to want to show you different ways that mm -hmm. now you can use it into the way of making a zigzag heart. Oh, lovely, lovely, yes. That's so nice. that way you have got that. Or uh, this one I think is lit by Linda Parker. Ooh. Thank you everybody. Look at that. <gasps> like an easel card. Like, well, you can do an easel oh, card easel, as well. Um, what's a, the word? a zigzag, a gateful. No, I don't know what. Uh, concertina. Thank concertina. You. Concertina. Yes. <laughs> but also, of course, don't forget that you are getting the, uh, the kind of the diamond panel in here. Mm -hmm. So that one again for the, uh, that's the by uh, Linda. Yeah. Uh, that one as well. So you can use it as your inks in here. And then also you can do like a zigzag pattern as well. So right. if you want to create your basic of the car, basis of the card, I want to show you a couple more. That Very one contemporary, Lisa. aren't they? Yeah, look at that. But you can have it like for a Christmas. It can be for a man. It can be for a more geometric. And of course, the easel that you mentioned, it's not finished. I didn't have time to oh, finish that. But you can create an easel card as well. Cute. That's lovely. And yeah. You can just use a little piece, bits and pieces to, deca to decorate your cards as well. Yeah. Love it. So you've seen the concept now. You've seen the lovely samples. This is a gorgeous one day special. I love being able to make cards that are a little bit different, but there's no scoring. There's no, you know, you, yeah. the dies do it for you. And you've got some gorgeous patterns on here. £34.98 is the price. There we go. 580150 is your item number. Now we have more Bright Rosa products on the show for you. Um, so this next one is the Sunflower Band. 
and also the sunflower border. Oh, yeah. we've got some borders. Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry, I put them down. Um, right. right. Yeah, so this one is the new uh, the new flower bed. Now, I had done previously a flower bed, and that was, uh, you know, like really, really popular, and I wanted to do something that kind of worked with it, but mostly it has a little bit of a bigger size. So it's it's kind of a space on a sunflower or a dahlia or a gerbera. It's, my flowers are not the specific flowers, even though I have called them sunflower, just to differentiate from the first one. Yeah. But it's just more of a 12-point flower. The previous one's six, so they kind of mixes and matches as ah, well. So I keep very it. Nice. So, so you can. Uh, anyway, so here you are getting the big um, band, which is six inches. Uh, sorry, yeah, it will be a fl the flower will be six inches. Wow! But you are also getting the mini one, which is as a new in innovation mm -hmm. uh, or new uh, incorporation. So the, the, this one is the one that the flower itself is six inches. The, the width will be uh, about. I think it's about. Uh, is it eight? <laughs> it's kind of we can, we can measure it. Later. We can measure it. Yeah. But you have got like different bits and pieces to go in the center, and then you have got the smaller one. Now the smaller one is uh, this one. It's just basically because I wanted to create a pop-up that would fit onto a six by six card oh. or a six. So then you have got the big flower That's gorgeous. with the center. Yeah. Okay, let me let me hold it like You're this. Right. Yeah. There you go. And then you could open it and have the pop-up flower, oh, the so mini nice. one, um, that still would fit on a six inch width because the Brilliant. other ones were a little bit bigger, so you need a bigger card. Yeah. So obviously uh, here I have used the larger card, I have a larger flower on the front. <gasps> but Love that. See, that's a little surprise when yeah. you open up the card. Yes, that's that. So then, of course, you can use them as uh, as uh, as kind of bands around presents and things like that. Mm -hmm. But you also included, you're getting the borders. Now, this border is a little bit like the snowflake border, so it's the smaller ones. They are not meant to be um, like the original flower border, is, which we have it, by the way, in the show. Um, it's a little bit longer. This one was big, big for more de uh, smaller details delicate. around delicate, but it has been designed that you can elongate it if you want it. Right. You can continue it, but if you don't want to, you can just use it into a little cards as well. Oh, look! Can I show this yes, one? Yes, exactly. The big yeah. One. yeah. Look at that on a gift box. So we have to say thank you to Lisa, who I'm sure is just watching. She's a great friend of mine, and mm -hmm. she has made amazing samples as per usual. So this is the, actually the concept of the bands were originally to wrap around, right. you know, boxes or mm -hmm. gift boxes or cards and things like that. So you can do that for you know those bigger presents to have the big band <gasps> nice. in there. But you can then take it into a six by six by card yep. as well. So it's bright and cheerful. I have to thank uh, Sam Clayton for this one. So you can see it in here that gorgeous. Flowers. So can you see how it the band yeah. opens up? So you have got that ability to create that mini albums and things like that, but completely different as mm -hmm. well. Kind of go in some yeah. more and more natural looking. I also wanted to show you that you can create uh, three-dimensional flowers like with tissue paper. We've just made rosettes for the, you know, like there are so many different ways of using. It is a large flower. Absolutely. You know? Sorry, my blue flower is photo bombing. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, but that's that's, that's <laughs> oh, by the way, Linda has made the blue flower, and I just love. I mean, imagine making it into a, like a proper sunflower or yeah. gerbera. It's just that sort of sizes that you can create with them. <gasps> And then fabulous. that one again for, uh, by Linda Park. Uh, Linda. So she has used, you can see the smaller flowers individual from mm -hmm. the uh, this uh, bundle. Then the one that is special, can you see here the postage stand and the pattern in there yep. as well. We ha The banner from the one that is special, those sentiments are as well. And then you have got the green edges as well as those ones which we have got as well on the, uh, on, on the show. Mm. And finally, can we show these? Uh, Linda, Linda yeah. Parker has made this one. So using, I think, a template plate or a die for a, a I think Helen does a yeah, lovely Yeah, very ones. similar to this. Helen uh, simply make crafts. Um, and then you can use the smaller one flower. You can see that it will still will fade and this is from the one day special as well. Marvellous. £31.98. Very busy for these because you can see how much potential you've got. 597632 is your item number. Then we're moving along. We've actually got a flower panel die set. Um, again, this is something really pretty and a little bit different when you see um, how this comes together. So that's what's on the packaging. Should we have a look yeah. at the... So, uh, so w w what you can do in there, basically I kind of love circles and I wanted mm. something that, you know, just an, a, 
One that it was a like kind of a circular card, but of course they had a so still, uh, still square. So now this one will fit on a six by six card. Uh, so you can cut it into the card or out of the card if you wanted to. I like to use the vellum. Uh, that's from the previous set, so the stems will work really well. Ah. And then you can open it up and can you see wow. how gorgeous the panel is. Yeah, love that. And then I have to, again, Lisa. Robson has made this gorgeous, can you see a paper piece in mm. color? This is one of my favorite yeah. parts, I have to say. It's just so beautiful. Any occasion. Yeah, and uh, just putting it onto an embroidery hoop. Mm. And then that works really well with the previous set as well. Absolutely. 1599 929 uh, 438. Do you want to quickly yeah, show that? Yeah, and if you want to see the dies that you are getting in here, so you can see. Yeah. Let's put the flowers. Outside. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's put them aside. Uh, so you can see that that will work in here. So those were corners. Now I, I was asked, say, why can you not put the corners just linked to it? And I was like, no, because sometimes you just want to do one corner, yeah, two corners. Good point. Sometimes you want to them, you know, you want to create effects like this. So therefore, you kind of have that option in there. Absolutely. There we go. And <laughs> so details are there on screen. Now we're moving to the next one, which is the flower border die set. Yeah. Uh, so this one is the original flower border. Ah. So I kind of wanted to end this set because if you look at it, uh, the one that is special, I mean, it is an amazing price, $12.99 for, for, for what you are getting. Mm. Um, you are getting so many dies in here. And if you have seen the one day special, that is just the flower that it featured. Everything uh. combines, the new flowers also will work with the one day special, but this is exactly the same flower. It's even the same sizes, so you can overlay. Good. So if you wanted to do the individuals yep. and to have them like popping up, you can do it. I haven't done that, but you can do that. Right. Let's so Oh, sorry, Lily. Yeah, no, no, no. And then, of course, things that you can do. So you have got the seven inches border because I wanted a nice long edge in there. So you can see in here that, you, and then you have got as well different ways of using it as well. So you, this I will cut. Sorry, the, the cut also the outer edge. Good. That one has got that one with the beautiful flowers, and then different ways that you can use them mm. as well. Very pretty. I love the blue one as well that's coming oh, up. Oh, th that one. Oh, yeah, that, that one. Yeah. Sorry, kind of got a model of it. And then that one. Yeah, and that. there you go. Look, that one's so pretty. I love it? that one. That was yeah. from Julie, so Julie Higgy. So thank you. Oh, Julie, yes. Hello, yeah. Julie, if you're watching. She's, she's in here sometime soon. Ah, good. Um, 12 99 uh, 398 is your item number. Then we go back to a couple of sets of two. So you've got your sweet words and your foliage tweaks. Okay. So this is like uh, the, the first collection I did the, the, uh, the ferns, and they were really popular. And I like things that are a little bit more three dimensional, that they're, they're a little bit more, uh, you know, big and bold for, uh, you know, making. F paper flowers yes. and things like that, so I needed foliage. So I decided to do that, and then also I wanted something, those words where a lot of people were saying, we want something more for art journaling, for home decor, for the things like So you have got here the combination of both. Now, you have got a uh, home, dream, I don't think it shows it. I think better probably the packaging shows it better. Mm -hmm. But I just wanted to show you that they are individual dies. So therefore, you can cut into the card or out of the card. You have got the options. And you have got the uh, script uh, words as well. Mm -hmm. You have got the outer one and then the more finer detail as well. And then, of course, included in this bundle, you are also getting the long the big the, the, yeah that i love that one so when you are creating flowers Yay. like this you have got a proper size foliage Absolutely. but of course then you can incorporate them into your carmine now i didn't have time to i wanted to print a picture in here but uh lisa has made this one as well and you can see how gorgeous mm. layer them up uh, how it looks into different projects like that it's nice to have sizable ones because a lot of the foliage you get yes. are really small exactly yeah. so, so th i like it them big so you can then trim them if you need to. That's really great. Ah, look, so here are all the words. You've got home, sweet, memories, dream, and Ooh. then create a, a sweet, loving new home. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. That's good. And make, so it's <laughs> make memories, uh, you know, you know, new, new memory, new, or this for something like sweet home, home sweet home in different yeah. ways. So there is different ways. Yeah. Very nice. Twenty-five pounds and ninety-eight pence. You've got twenty-three dies in total. Eight five nine one nine six is your item number. 
Next up, we have got the friend words and foliage sprigs. I can see how you're totally right. Absolutely everything on this counter works together. Yeah, it does. So basically what it, it when I put a collection together, I mean, I do listen to feedback as well. So I kind of what, what, what people want, but I am a crafter. This is why I started designing back in 2008, I think the first product that I designed. And it was always an, out of a need. Like, kind of, I, this is how I, I design product. It's yeah. always like, I wanted more words that you could use again for car making this one's more car making but a little bit those words also that you can incorporate into home decor or um, maybe art journaling but also they combine so they are six inches long yeah so they will fit with the original so the happy birthday the the thank you so you can say thank if you have got the originals mm -hmm. you can say thank you a beautiful friend for oh, instance. oh that's lovely or you can say, for instance, um, happy family, you know, mm -hmm. if you are doing memory albums. Yeah. If you have got the original happy and wishes and things like that. And here you're getting lovely, beautiful family and friends. And then you have got the four special A, hello and friend. So you can say for a special friend or for a, sp you know, or hello friend, yeah. hello lovely, um, hello beautiful. Mm -hmm. uh, so, so you can say, so for instance, in here you can see in the cards. Now, I did this one specifically to show you that even though they're six inches long, you can still fit into, because the words will fit into oh, four inches. Yep. So you can fit in there, but then you can also combine it with, you know, that special thing. And then you have I've got the stamps as well in later on. That's yeah. great stuff. And then you've got a lovely sample down here because you are getting the foliage sprigs yes. as well. So that's a really nice sample. Yeah. It almost looks a little bit mistletoe or something it, like that. Well, it is, it is actually, uh, I know the name in Spanish, paniculata <laughs> or atrapanovios, uh, <laughs> which is uh, basically is baby's breath. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, so it's, on a, it's an illustration that, oh, by the way, now is a good time to mention uh, Alex Hunt, which is the graphic designer that you know has helped me to put the packaging and a lot of different items in here. Oh, okay. Thank you, Alex. I thought you, I thought you met me. I was like, I've oh, done sorry. <laughs> sorry. Alex, too. Yeah. Also, for <laughs> keeping me company and... <laughs> Let me ramble on. <laughs> <laughs> you are lovely. Right, so this is 24.98.469.446. And then we've got one more to show you, and then we'll crack on with the demos. Uh, so here we've got some stamps. Now, mm. Yes, so these are stamps are, uh, you know, I designed them. Uh, now, I have to say, like, this is the first time that I have done is It's a material called uh, TPR or something like that. It's basically the ones, the same raw materials that Jane Davenport and other people use them. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I just wanted to make sure that, you know, you know that. Word. Now, there are two sets. In here you have got the birthday wishes which is more car making sort of thing and then you have got their beautiful words which is you can incorporate them into car making but also into more art journaling so what I have done is for, for instance I wanted something like birthday wishes happy birthdays hello friend sending words like that that you can then stamp and then trim and put them into your cards right but also some foliage some something for the background something to add some detail in there and then I like that <laughs> uh, quote. Be, be weird. Be it. random, be who you are. I mean, I'm randomly weird. I'm definitely <laughs> weird. Definitely. Well, we are all. <laughs> you need to be weird to work here. Yeah, right. you know, like, there is no, you know, it's like, um, yeah, it's somebody in, the, in, in our ears are going like, no, no, I'm not. Oh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, definitely we are all. But you can say make a smaller cards and you have got to like, celebrate. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to incorporate numbers as well because it's something that I remember. I kind of forgot that. In my one of my first stamp sets that I had designed, it had numbers and I wanted to incorporate them. And of course, you can use them for art journaling as well if you wanted to. So the stamps in here, I like to layer mine. I like to combine with previous things that I have mm -hmm. got. And I wanted that beautiful thing, take time. This is kind of, oh, what is it? Uh, yeah. They have got another page, but I don't know where it is. And then, and then you can see there, you want to ah, dial yes. it. So you have, and also I wanted here, now this was one idea here that I have been playing with for months. All the, you know, words that we should use about us, like, yeah. you know, strong, confident, beautiful, and things yeah. like that, that maybe, you know, it's just, it's just you know, good to reinforce that, you, we know, we all are those mm -hmm. things, and we need to kind of... Empowerment. Uh, empowerment, yes. empower, and <laughs> believe, believe. Believe you're beautiful. Exactly. Right. Uh, so this is £16.98, 445886 is your item number. Here's the website, so you can check out everything else that we've got on the show. Um, because we've also got these items that are now available individually because I don't believe they were previously. So if you 
didn't want to get the bundle from the last time, you just want the one or two, there you go, perfect. Um, and there are the stamps as well. Now, if you want to show any of your makes from when Bright Rosa has been on previously, oh, now wait until this oh, yes. comes up. You're gonna have to wait till after the first demonstration. We will be doing an unveiling later, unless it sells out. I hope it doesn't before, because oh, I haven't seen what's in the box. Oh. I'm literally leaving it as a surprise. Uh, how much has gone? 20% and these are Paula's designs. They are indeed. What's in the box? Oh, it is, uh, I had so much fun. It's, 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 it's one of those ones that I kind of put together yeah. and with the help of Alex as well. Uh -huh. And it was just so nice to, to when it came and it's just all the bits. And I hadn't designed um, die cut sheets for, yeah. well, it was one of the first things I designed in 2009, I think it was. And, and I was kind of suddenly like, oh, how do I do this? And yeah. how, you know, but I'm so oh. happy how it all works. So, you know, with all of these Bright Rosa products, yeah. are they all your designs? They are all my designs. Oh, amazing. Yeah. So okay. I work with a graphic designer obviously because you know I uh, need some help but um, but yeah I'd, uh, I kind of asked our uh, you know it's just it's just my designs yeah how do you get the time Paula uh, well these ones it's, it's, it does take a little bit of time but um, yeah it's just it's one of those things uh, but these ones I design before I uh, join full-time oh here. really so, so okay. it's been, yeah because I forget that it takes time the whole process oh it does it? I mean it does um, because I, I kind of, I used to be a graphic designer and I used to work at a, at a printer, so kind of I'm used to the graphic design program. So, right. but it's still they take time, and sometimes, of course, it's a team that they always mm. put so he helps out. So, so it kind of it makes uh, sense to you know back and forward. Sometimes things you know need to be like in a way. Now, uh, what I'm gonna do is gonna put uh, through, um, pop it up, and there you have it. So it was just a couple of ones, but that is. Look at that, perfect. Look at that. A card in one place. And it uh, uh, also scores it down there. And that, that's it. I mean, that's, that's the basic of, of basis of the card. And it will mm. stand up. Good. I mean, nice. obviously, it's kind of, I'm going to put it white on white, so it's not the best. Now, um, now what I could you can do here, now it's the thing is like, you have got options. So you can leave it as it is and color it up, for instance, for a wedding. Uh, now, uh, you, if you wanted to, um, you have got the corners as well here. Now, these corners, obviously, if you're using that one and that one, you're going to use the same one mm -hmm. as this one. Uh, but I have given you the other option as well, if you, because, I don't know, you might want to use Absolutely. it in a different way. Yeah. So then I'm going to put that one in here. Because you could just literally have the four corners on the card and use it in a completely different card. Indeed. For instance, the also included in the one day special, you are getting the panel, right, mm -hmm. which is a five by seven. So if you wanted ah. to use just the corners in there, you could do that as well. Now, I'm going to open. So now what you need to do is place the, 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 the open die light so. Uh, the, the, the cards are not open. Close it up. Mm -hmm. Place it up. Now, this is the you will need an A4 die cutting machine just because it is a five by seven. So yeah. when a car, so when it's open, yeah. it's um, seven by ten inches and a bit. Therefore, you do need an A4 die cutting machine. It works on the, uh, your. Um, Platinum on your Big Shop Plus, on your, um, you know, I'm using the Tangerine, the Gemini, you mm -hmm. know, whichever is standard die cutting machine you have got, any lady one. Now, see, you can see there. Very nice. pretty. Now, you are going to take, it's a good idea to always clean your uh, dies. And by cleaning, I mean just basically with as few pieces of paper into your die as possible. The reason being is that if you have got pieces of paper stuck in there, it means that the blade is not as deep. Yeah. Okay? So I have I have learned this lesson at home. <laughs> so therefore it would maybe it would if if it's a thicker card or something like that, it wouldn't cut as well. Now I'm gonna put it again here. So now what you do is again you put the corner and you line it up with those lines in here. Ah lovely. Open it up. Mm -hmm put low tack tape and then run it through. Now, if you also With want, yeah, yeah. yeah, you want, don't want any of those bits. I know you know, Alex, but oh you know, no, it's all good. <laughs> but um, <laughs> at, at home, if those ba white bits, they are when you put it them through the die cutting machine, what happens is that they, with the pressure of the machine, mm. it will emboss and leave a mark. And it's and really you, annoying. <laughs> it is. I mean, there is always different ways of fixing yeah. it. But, you know. but, but you're so right though, you know, we get new viewers every day. Hey, when this channel launched, I had no idea what all this was about. Yeah, exactly. 
Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So um, yeah, and I still yeah we get new viewers every day. Now gently tease it off and then just put it back there. So now can you see that we start building that bit? There. Pretty, very yeah. pretty. Okay. Yeah, good. So there we hit. And see, this is the point of that. It's on the point, but it's still uh, standing up. Because I like that ethereal. Now, I'm using thin cord. I'm not using very thick cord. Some of our, uh, the design team have gone, uh, you know, like I have used 300 GSM cards if you wanted to, and that's absolutely fine. Um, but, you know, obviously, depending on the die cutting machine, you will need a little bit more once or twice if you're using thicker card. Yeah. Oh, no. I do like a bit of vellum. Oh, uh, yeah, I just can't. Oh, I, I, I'm I, I, I've done that wrong as well. Oh. Not the wrong. Uh, it's just like I, I jump ahead a few a few steps. So oh, all right. Kind of, it's all right. It will be ready for later on. Yeah. So this is one of the dice. <laughs> so there it is. So you can see that those ones I have die cut as well out of white card. Mm -hmm. Now what I'm going to do here is color them. Now to color them I have got Phil Martin, Sentimentally Yours, the watercolor Ooh. blending brush. So I'm going to just sh show you quickly how I kind of start. Now you can find... Oh, no. Um, do I say this bit? <laughs> no, it doesn't matter. It's absolutely fine. <laughs> Go on, you can do it. It's just so funny. I'm just so. It's, it you have to get your guest head on, and then yeah, you present her head. Yeah. It's so funny. Anyway, they are on the website. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, the, and they are absolutely glorious colors. Now, they have got a soft brush mm. in there, so you can go really, really detailed. Now, I'm not going to do this for a long time, but I'm going to just show you how you can go in there mm -hmm. and then warm it up, or maybe a little bit. Oh, that's nice. They blend well, Yeah, then. they do blend very well. So you can go in with a different color. And I kind of want gone for warmer tones since it's quite cold out there. Yes. And in <laughs> here, I probably is. I'm, I'm quite warm, but <laughs> but you can no go. No, outside it's freezing. I just thought, uh, no, I can actually go with a little bit of red. So then, basically, you color in as you wash. What you can use alcohol markers as well. It's up to you mm -hmm. what you do. So now, what I have done, then I have gone ahead and done one that I done earlier. Fast so forward. So you can see that you can color them up mm. later. Bit of sparkle too. Oh yeah, I added a little bit of a sparkle. Yes, yeah, a little bit of um, what is it called? It's a uh, it's it's a wink of Stella. Oh right. No. Yes, uh, so there are different ways of doing this one. Now you can create an aperture in here yep. or you can create it into um, a piece of card. It's up to you. I'm going to create the aperture because I just like the ethereal nature of this die. Mm -hmm. So again, here you have uh, the option whether you want the, you can see that it's not symmetrical. So which, whichever you want the larger one. So like the card is uh, standing here. So do I want it the larger one? I'll do the larger flower facing that um, and in this side yep. you can have it that way as well now remember to open up the the the, the, the card otherwise it would cut into into the bottom layer mm -hmm. or create an indentation which could be another look but um, I don't want that so I'm just going to put secure it well with card you could create also a frame. You could maybe done it into black card as well. There is so many ways mm. of. Oh, now I'm thinking that would have looked <laughs> really nice if I yeah. done. Oh, maybe tomorrow's demos. Yeah, it, that's the thing. Is that one of those says that there are so many options in here. Mm. So, and then, and then you have got here. And Ooh, well gently, yeah, gently tease it off because there is so much detail in here that it you want to gently tease it off. Yeah, mm. not rip it. Yeah, yeah. That's it. I'm a bit heavy-handed sometimes. <laughs> now I ha I'm still using very thin card as you can see because I just kind of is what I like to use at the minute. But then you put the the vellum, and that will add some some. Oh, I, I know really what I'm like going to do. What, what? Oh, I'm going to change my Are you mind. going on, on a tangent? On a tangent, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to put that, and then with uh, with wet glue, you just want to put this the minimum amount, especially when you are have got, got vellum. Uh, but uh, Or you could use a specific v parchment glue. I'm just kind of, I'm living dangerously. Mm. I'm just living on the edge. Yeah, well, it's Phil Martin's um, glue, which oh, is yes. quite tacky. So it doesn't quite, it's not those one of those ones that is very wet. So I'm just gently, you know, rubbing it on mm -hmm. to make sure that it has made contact all over it. 
Yeah. Okay, 20% of the one day special has already gone. 20% gone, super busy out there, and we're only half past the hour. So in 30 minutes, 20% is gone. Okay. Yep. All right, so what I'm doing, sorry, apologies for that. This is kind of, uh, it's my fault. I should have done that beforehand. Now, I have got this in here. So I'm going to go in. So that uh, diamond shape that I had before. So I'm going to go in with some of the stress oxides. And then going in, well, that's not the right color, but anyway. And mix them in here. I really think I need a set of these brushes. Oh, you do? Because I like the way it goes on. Oh, it's just so much easier. It's smooth, isn't it? It is so yeah. much easier. I'm going to take a little bit of orange. I didn't, oh, I didn't bring the orange here. Um, and yeah, so that kind of goes in. And then what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to put it behind it. So instead of colouring in oh, here. Oh, lovely. So you can just see how it's going to pop up through the that's going to go in there. It's a warm glow there through yeah. that, yeah. So there is a different way that you can use it, um, you know, the, the different elements. Mm. Okay, so I'm going to put it out with some glue or adhesive. Now I'm going to put it in, let's put it in the right place. Um, um, Okay, sorry. And this, this is the longest thing to take to glue that. <laughs> yeah. Now, that is there. Pretty. Now, mm. then, I'm going to take the stamps. Now, included in the one day special, you are also getting a banner that fits right there. So, that kind of. So, that banner, so what sort of sentiment shall we put in here? Uh, so, we could say, beautiful things take time. Oh, that's nice. You brighten my day. Oh, that one's lovely as well. Follow your heart, but take your heart with. Uh, no, follow your heart, but take your brain with you. Yeah, I like that one. Uh, that's the original <laughs> one, actually. Um, that's actually Leone uh, gave me a once uh, one present, uh, uh, and it, it had that on. I like it. And then it was like I did some research, and it was okay to use. So kind of going. Now for the stamps, I'm gonna use. Uh, what is that? What is it? Uh, black ink. Oh, do I have black ink somewhere mm -hmm. here? I'm a, I'm a little bit all over the place today, <laughs> am I not? Uh, they're 16.98, as you can see, 445886. Oh, and it's 48 stamps. Very useful. Uh, now, uh, what I'm doing, and you're thinking, oh, why is she using a stamp platform? Well, the reason being is because oh, my acrylic blog is somewhere. Uh, <laughs> but somewhere very safe. Yeah, but the reason also being uh, that I can go in and I know that I will get it right. Now, see, also, I lo do love this sound perfect. Now, I also can go in and to make sure, if I do it with an acrylic block, I wouldn't necessarily know exactly what I'm stamping. But like this, with the dye, I can go perfectly, more, more or less. Mm. I mean, nothing that I do is ever perfect, but you know. And then, uh, now, f for uh, these stamps, what you want to use is, see, this is one of the reasons why I use um, stamping platform, because yeah. then you can go in. Uh, you want to use um, VersaFine, okay. or even uh, Distress Oxides really stamp very well. Now, I wouldn't use, what is it? My cleaning, oh, anyway, I'll leave it as it is. I wouldn't use uh, dye base inks onto these sort of acrylic uh, stamps because okay. then they are the ones that pull a little bit. But with VersaFine, you're getting a fabulous, fabulous yeah, that's uh, good. version. Now, there we have it, more or less in the center. Then just put it there with the banner. Now, also, I'm going to do these ones. Uh, so, uh, I don't know where I put the other two. Now, included, the, you have got also these little, can you see that? Oh, cute. Shall I put? No, I can actually. They don't fit because of that. What? That so are they like little reinforcers? So no, or they, are they are. Well, I'll show you what they do. Uh, so basically, they cut a hexagon, yeah, three hexagons into anything that you wanted to put oh, it right. in. All right, that's cute. So then that kind of adds a pattern. It's just because I had a space, and since I had used uh, hexagons for the pattern, I thought, mm. well, I know a protein are ones like her tiny hexagons, yeah. so then you can use them in other projects, you know, not just, not just, anyway. you got so versatility then. Yeah. Mm. They're, They're really sticking to that tonight. Yeah, they are. <laughs> there it, it is, just kind of, yeah, I'm just wait, what is, <laughs> what's that? So, there you have. Can you see That's how cute. they got, 
Yeah. So, so that that's just kind of a little, and you get two because then if you wanted to do in the banner, then you have would have the banner. Now you have got the banner in here. So the original one I did it on them. Oh, you were that right. one. Yep. So that one was vertical. So you can do it vertical or you can put it horizontal. Mm -hmm. So what about let's do um, just a little, let's do horizontal in there, and then you can thread it through. Mm -hmm a little bit through the flowers in there. There. I like, like that, that ladies. Yeah. I mean, you can color the flowers, but I'm going to leave them plain. Now, the other thing is that these little things, you can do oh. use them for the centers of the flowers. Oh, adorable. Because one of the reasons being that they are actually um, the size, they, they are hexagons, so therefore the flowers are six-pointy, so, six points of the hexagon. Yeah, that fits brilliantly. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like this, see. You think of everything, but of course you're a crafter. Wait, wait, I should have coloured them beforehand. Oh, well. <laughs> okay. Oh, so good. No, no, the, uh, there. Yep. Okay, and then I'm going to put another one in here. And there should be another one because I cut three. Yep. And then Perfect. And then you can go in. Oh, I should glue this. Shouldn't I? Forgot that I hadn't glued it. I just positioned it. Then just gonna put in a little bit of the glue in Secure there. Secure that down. So it can fall and out. then maybe a little bit of yellow in the center. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that that's kind of nice. Yeah. And then the pink in there. So now suddenly it pops yeah, up it pops a little bit. That's a beautiful power. So you have got the option. I mean, obviously you can go a little bit more into there or mm -hmm. doing like this or here I have colored it yeah. with the inside flowers as well so you have got the different options. Stunning thank you so much Paola I love that demo these dyes are awesome aren't they. Uh, now the deal of the day let's give you a little um, flash of that if you haven't yet seen it now it, you're getting A4 card collection uh, it's all in white but there are sorted finishes and from memory you've got super smooth, you've got your smooth and then you've also got your watercolour card. A hundred sheets in total and it ranges from 160 GSM to 290 GSM. Thank you, he's saying well done because I've remembered all that. Uh, 145224 is your item number and you're saving £11. Here is your um, one day special. It's beautiful because it's also very contemporary and it's very different. Um, so, or in my opinion it is. I, I really like this. Look at these samples. Look how you can create so many different looks with them. It could be for all occasions. It could be thank you cards. It could be, I love this sweet friend. Um, it could be anniversaries, birthdays, of course. Um, and I, I just really, really love the design of this and um, whether you want to do easel cards stand it on its side um, it's just fabulous and then we've got this other one now this other one I think um, lends itself for both male and female cards and even you know teenagers kids because it's quite funky really like this and then if we show you some more samples I'm, I'm loving these so you've got a card in one purse if you want. It literally just opens up like that, pop a sentiment in there. But then you've got this beautiful one on its side. And then we've got this one that's, uh, again, look at that. I mean, it's just, it's so striking, isn't it? How beautiful. Now let me find another one of the other dies so you can see, look at this. Because of course, don't forget, you can stencil through your dies. That's beautiful with some inks. Create your shaker cards with these absolutely stunning um, oh look at this one as well on the box this is thinking literally outside the box so it's just used part of it i like that a lot anything in it oh are you ready look at that that's awesome uh, right now uh, we are a quarter of the stock gone of your one day special and we're only 38 minutes past our first hour uh, 34 pounds and 98 pence 580150 um, so you're saving that five pounds on there and you've got 24 dies in total uh, next up then we have got our sunflower band and we've got our sunflower border and so these have been really busy um, if i just very quickly show you the boards 
and then I can show you a few samples. So here are your main ones. So you've got that sort of belly band on them, really. You've got your band. Uh, lo lovely large dies, right the way through to your small dies. But just check this out. How nice is this on your gift boxes? But of course, it doesn't have to be on your gift boxes. It can be. I just need to put this down because I'm all fingers and thumbs. Sorry. I'm just, I don't want to wreck the set. Hang on a second. OK, right. So um, cards. And then you've got even your, your little elements there that make it so sweet, don't they? And then, I mean, just what about this for a wreath? I think that's gorgeous. And then, of course, last but not least, we have got to show look what you can be doing look you can make beautiful pieces of home decor and we've got i mean this one out of tissue paper it's just divine right 31 pounds and 98 pence 597632 is your item number Next up, we've got the flower panel die set. Again, this is nice and contemporary, and you'll see that absolutely everything works together. Have a look at this. Be again, again, this has got that lovely modern feel. Do you know what? I can see stained glass windows with this. Well, I tell you what, it's because I'm inspired by this first sample that I've um, picked up. So you could, if you want to, um, pop it onto acetate, maybe. And then if maybe if you do... Uh, what's the word, you know, like um, alcohol markers on acetate in the background, and then you can put the silhouette over the top. It's just a little idea for you. Oh, and look at that. Isn't that so pretty? Again, this could be for absolutely any occasion. Uh, £15.99, 929438. Then we have got the flower border die set. Now, this has got 13 dies in total. I think this one's a back by popular demand. Um, but look at what you can be creating. It's so nice. I like the way that it sort of undulates. Uh, new individually, right, that's it. Um, and then we've got, look there, so you can create it on the inner part of the card if you want. Oh, what about this one? As a little gatefold. And if we open it up, there you go. And that's so sweet. I love that on both sides. Um, so, um, and what about at the top? So you can position it any which way that you like. 12.99 398 118 then we've got the sweet words and foliage twigs <laughs> i'm just chuckling at how ross our producer is going moving on <laughs> after everyone <laughs> love that um right so here we've got your home sweet memories and dream and then of course you can mix and match them up and then you've got create a sweet loving new make and then you can as i said you can position them however you like um, how about create a, create a sweet make? As in like you could be making a cake or of course your cards. <laughs> uh, so yeah, have a little play. And then you've also got our uh, twigs. Now these are a good size. You know, quite often you see quite teeny twigs and that's absolutely fine. But sometimes, you know what? It's nice to have something that's quite nice and large. And um, here, you see, then they'll work really well with the flowers. That's perfect sizing. And we've got another sample with our twigs on. It's really pretty, isn't it? Um, gorgeous. £25.98. 859196 is your item number for those. And then <laughs> we have got... Uh, next set we've got, and again they work absolutely in tandem, we've got our friend words and our foliage sprigs. Oh, oh, <laughs> it's all right, Ross. There you go. Uh, so t um, we will just get the details. £24.98 for this set. And you've got 20 dies in total. They work fantastically together. I love this sample. Isn't that so pretty? Um, just cut in white. But I really like the design. I really like the shape of them. Of course, you can get your gems on those little b berries. You can get your Nouveau drops or your stickles on there or just colour it in. Um, very pretty. And then, of course, we come to the words. And on this one, we've got lovely, beautiful family friend for special A. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, hello, friend. And then, of course, this matches with the one you've just seen previously. Uh, £24.98, 469446. And then last but not least, we've got our birthday wishes and our birthday words. Now, these are stamps, of course, and you've got 48 stamps in total. They're your essentials that you need in your crafty stash. 
Can I pick one up to have a read? Okay, so here we've got happy birthday just for you. Thank you so very much. Celebrate, today is the day, you brighten my day. Hello, beautiful things take time. Uh, you are, and then you've got celebrate. Oh, I like this, this is really empowering. Loyal, funny, smart, kind, generous, creative. And you've got happy, loved, lush, lush, love that word. Crazy, passionate, and you've got a nice worker stamp. And then be weird, be random, be who you are. Very nice, and then very quickly, uh, this one has got love, birthday wishes, with love on your, have a wonderful sending, love and laughter, laughter and cheer, hugs and love, L I just adorable all of these, for the best, wishing you a very happy, dazzling, I like dazzling, and then again you've got some more worker stamps, a one, to a wonderful, may your whole day sparkle, um, so you can see 48 stamps in total, for £16.98, Item number is 445886. Here's the website, or you can call us on the usual number, 01733 um, If you want to, oh, I'm excited what's coming up now. If you do want to send in any pictures from anything that you've been making from when Paula's previously bought Bright Rosa on, you can now get those um, edge dies. You can now get those edge dies individually if you want to. But um, part of me is now, I'm going to do a drum roll. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I'm going to do a drum roll. That's a bit loud. <laughs> <laughs> because this is your baby. Yeah, it is. Is this the third in the instalment? Yes, so every month, Paper Class Society is like a subscription, or you mm. can buy sometimes I have it them on her channel. We bring very few on her channel. So, and every month is a different crafter that kind of inspires or works and designs. Um, so uh, this month is my one, December, Yay! that's properly. So uh, last, uh, you know, the first and the second sold out really quickly. So if you wanted to go for it, please do not wait. Now, so I kind of wanted, and uh, well, anyway, so it's a you know, it kind of has got a lot of goodies. So uh, this one, I kind of want like celebrate love, Yay. fun, friendship with this kid. Is that your writing? Or no, 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 oh, no. I just wondered. No. If you'd and then, it. Yeah, but this is kind of things that I have worked for a long time, and like kind of the design of the wallet and things like that. So uh, then you open it up, oh, I love and it. then you can have here that kind of goes in and in and keeps going. So you have got a lot of goodies in here. So it is one of like it's a collective. Item. So you yep. have got the dice in here. So you have got now they are tabs. So I kind of bend them across yeah. board. So you have got the square ones to create that kind of mat matting and layering. And then you so by six by six, I think is that it. And then you have got the different elements. So you can see the kind of my fonts that I like to use. And then the hearts as I kind of follow and incorporate some stars because it was all about love and friendship and things like that. And then you have got also the the stamps in here and what I wanted to is they are not repeated and if they work really well I'll put it like this so you can see it mm -hmm. they are work really well with the stamps that we have Absolutely. got so basically if you're thinking if you put them side by side you can see that they kind of sort of go together but they are not the same so they are the same fonts but not you know, so you can mix and match as well. Now this is because I use a lot of uh, washi tape that is oh. that sort of pattern, and I wanted to incorporate the washi tape. And then I said, somebody said, well, maybe, maybe why, why don't you put it as a, a stencil? And I said, well, what about a stamp that yep. kind of works? And then we have got, the this is what I was talking about, uh, the first product that I designed was a circles designed like with words, and that's the first, like if I'm going to like this, like this I'm going to say. Uh, so you can see, so that I wanted to incorporate them because it was the first product that I ever designed, and it was for craft or cars a long time ago. Mm -hmm. So I went, it's a different size, obviously, different, uh, different fonts, but then I wanted bits and pieces that kind of work, and those words that, you know when, when we were talking about the stamp yeah. that yeah, had yeah. Those are uplifting, reinforcing words that it's nice to use them for our friends, for also for ourselves yeah. because it's it's important too. And then the other thing that we are getting in here is the papers as well as the stencil. I mean, oh yeah, there it is. It has kind of gone. So you also designed this stencil in mm -hmm. here. So you have got a stencil that uh, doesn't show. Now the stencil, now the flower kind of combines with the dye as well, and mm -hmm. that kind of combines with um, the the, the the heart as well. Now, if you are thinking, what are these are flowers, right? That is like a, spat, a splatter of paint. But if you overlay it, I think it's this way mm. or this way. What is it? 
Do you want to hand? Yeah, trying Let's, to. There you go. I'll take that. Where is it? That way. This this way? Yeah, this way. Okay. <laughs> okay. So if you can see that, it's the centers of the flowers. Oh, okay. So yep. you can. It's a splatter of a paint. Also, you can then stamp the centers. And of course, I wanted. There was a little bit of an edge here. So mm. I, obviously, yours will come clean. This is mine. Uh, <laughs> you can see in here that I uh, these dots are from my packaging. Uh. So there was a little bit of it, and I thought, well, I love those dots, so I wanted to incorporate them. Gorgeous. Um, I think we're half the stock gone. Yes, over half the stock gone. Um. So, and then you're also getting a papers. And again, I want to thank Alex for helping me out with <laughs> everything, especially with the papers. And not but me, you Alex. can no, no, the <laughs> Alex. And, yeah. So you can see that you have got pa papers in here. So that is just kind of to give you a selection of papers in there. Two thirds gone. Okay. This is and then, last. okay. Now it gets to the, the bits where it's like so much fun. Now I, I, ha I never done this before. Oh, it's kind of, I put it. Have they got paper powder on? No, no, it's Paper Craft Society. Oh. <laughs> but I'll have to say that uh, you can see here, I, ha I never done this before. Mm. I selected my own Pantone colors cool. to create ink pads and they are a spot. Yeah, they're exactly the colors and these ones if anybody knows me they are my to go to colors it's like a pink mm. uh, this time I have gone more for a coral a lime apple greeny and then a teal sort of turquoise color they also included you are getting oh you are sorry yeah, it is yeah. Uh, you are getting the blending buds which are tiny uh, then you are getting crystals because the sparkle you know uh, limited stock uh, sorry, a baker's wine so in black and white it. because I use them all, all the time to wrap around. And you also include it in here. Sorry, mine are kind of wendy with ink. Uh, you can see in here the matching up. It uh, says cardstock. I would think is thick paper. Okay. I mean, I'm not going to say that this is cardstock because it's it's kind of. But it has got the silver, the ma nice brushed silver in here, which is really nice because it's it's thin, so you can like yeah. cut and round. So that is a really something that I really wanted to do it oh they think it's all over it is now uh, thank you if you purchased that had we just got to the end uh, as well? yeah we, we we did we did yeah. we, so, so we, we saw, saw everything, everything. Yeah, yeah we did yeah so um, kind of put it and of course you can keep it everything in a in a box so make sure now uh, right so thank you if you purchased that this is sold out a technical sellout, so just in case any bounce back, we'll let you know. Do you think you can do something uh, for yes. five minutes? Yes, uh, sorry, yeah, let me grab the quick demo. I was going to do a more elaborate one, but I'm going to do uh, a quick one with the one day special because I don't have time to. Sorry, right, lovely. Uh, no, but we are back. <laughs> no, it's so funny. It's just like I don't know what to say. I'm <laughs> sorry, I'm <laughs> still in <nightmare guess. laughs> Say it, say it, go, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> We're back at nine. <laughs> back at eight. No, eight. Eight, eight, eight. eight, 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 yeah. eight. eight. Nine, yeah. Do, uh, well, tomorrow I'm nine. Mm. Uh, so, um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the one day special, the panel. Now, because is uh, when I'm, I think it was my second collection, when I was thinking about sizes, yeah. I kind of went for five by seven because, again, it's one of the, the those sizes that I remember when I first came to this country and I started making cars. Before it used to be oh, either DL or A6 that I used to do, but when I came here, I wanted something a little bit in between an A5 right. and an uh, A6. So then 5x7, and I didn't know that it was called a 5x7. Oh, so right. I, I used to call it something completely different. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, it's one of those sizes. Now, this is a a present. It, 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 this box it came, it was a, like a toiletries from a friend of oh, mine. Yeah. And what it is, it's a five by seven, a little uh -huh. bit bigger. So there is a size that you will find a lot of different um, boxes, mm. frames, that they do work with a five by seven. Hence, that is why I kind of went for it. Uh, and I'm quite glad that I went for these sizes. Also, because Christina Griff, you know, Christina has got that gorgeous uh, box kit that is five by seven. So if yeah. you wanted to go for it, that those panels will work on the box. Brilliant. Well. Mm -hmm. So this is just uh, what I did with the box. I spray painted mm -hmm. uh, with silver, so you can use a, a you know acrylic paint or something like that, and then trans completely transform it by using the dyes, and then suddenly becomes. Um, as our uh, producer was saying, I'm very, very right. It's kind of an art they call Great Gatsby. Uh, yeah. 
you know, other Art Deco sort of feel to it. Mm. So I'm kind of pulling gently because this is paper, remember? Yep. And this dice kind of cut really into it. Oh, and look. there. Very nice on there. There. Mm -hmm. So that you can see in the here. Now, uh, by the way, this is the silver paper that came, comes on the, on the, on the, on the Paper Craft Society, but of course you can use it in different ways. So you could then. I'm just going to help you out and poke oh the yeah, Oh, yeah, please do. <laughs> I was like, what is you doing? <laughs> Um, so, oh, do you know what it would have been really like? It's so nice. Like Ooh, with this nice. one, the foliage, to do them also on silver. Now I kind of uh, suddenly had my uh, uh, a thought, a thought. In my brain, there is a thought. <laughs> what colour are you going to do? It? A thought. <laughs> <laughs> They're being cheeky yeah. in our ears. Uh, let, but let me see if I can find. I want something. Uh, okay, so that's so uh, yeah there. It doesn't matter if you can of oh so the minute normal. forty five. Oh. Oh, I, I thought they were a minute. By. Yeah, it's flown, but but that that would look really nice. Yeah, well mm -hmm. it doesn't matter now. This foliage is the one that comes with friend, and I'm just kind of trying as fast as possible. Faster, 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 I always uh, Rick, and they look at the detail That's in really there. Nice. Now, when I, I was designing these ones, I wanted the little dots in the very center in everything because not only it pokes it out, but also it does a little bit of embossing, so it gives the more dimension in mm -hmm. there. That's so pretty, isn't it? Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. It's just it's just a little bit of a bit of, and then you could then do friend or family. So oh again, yeah. If which one shall I do do? Friend or family? Lovely. Oh, I don't mind. Friend. Friend. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So then you go in. Do you know this lovely background die? Yeah. Absolutely brilliant for paper piecing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, love that. And then it is paper piecing or, yeah. or a stencil as a stencil. Oh, yes, there's a, there's a sample like oh. that, actually. Oh, 30 seconds. 30 oh. seconds. Speed crafting. Uh, I don't think I will have time. Oh, I'm bless just you. kind of. Yeah, because I kind of line. Yeah, don't I'm just like He's like, oh, please. Go. 20 seconds. There we are. <laughs> <laughs> are you going to get a sweat on? Oh, well, at least my, my Ten arms. 10 seconds. A workout. I need a workout. Yeah. Six, five. There we go. Thank you, Paula. <laughs> we'll see you after the break.